Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 25th of 2023. Well, it is titled Cat's Eye Wide and Deep. So what do we see here? Well, this is what is known as the Cat's Eye Nebula, or known by its catalog designation of NGC 6543. And it is one of the more famous planetary nebulae in the sky. And if you look at the central region of it, that's what we're used to seeing as the, as the Cat's Eye Nebula. So that very central region of it. And it really depends when you take a much deeper image to see a larger region around it, we see that there is a lot more material than we are used to seeing there. Taking long deep exposures like this is one way to bring out much more detail in what we can other seen, otherwise see. And this takes an image that uses actually two different telescopes and shows us this outer halo. Now, what is the interest in the outer halo? Well, it is likely that the material means that the planetary nebula phase takes more time than perhaps we thought. Typically, we think of a planetary nebula phase lasting about 10,000 years. However, the outer portions of the structures that we see around it are almost 50 to 100,000 years old. Now that means that maybe planetary nebulae form more in stages than we previously thought. And again, we're still learning and understanding how these kinds of things work. Now this is what our sun will eventually become at the end of its life. It will shred out its outer layers and become a planetary nebula, perhaps visible to distant astronomers elsewhere in the galaxy at some point, many billions of years from now. But we don't quite understand exactly the process. We have a rough idea of what happens, but the details are still in question. Because when we look at planetary nebulae, we see a wide variety of structures within them. And as we start taking deeper and deeper images, we see that the planetary nebula phase is not always at least just shedding off those outer layers all at once, that it may occur in different stages and take time over the course of many tens of thousands of years for the nebula to form. And here when we look at the cat's eye nebula, the right the portion we're used to looking at at the center, that is only a small part of what actually happens at this stage of the end of the life of a star like our own sun. So that was our picture of the day for May 25th of 2023. It was titled Cat's Eye Wide and Deep. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture preview to be Virgo cluster galaxies. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.